Hey, welcome back to Cool Spot. This is indeed a let's play still. You're not dreaming, although you probably wish you were. And you I'm know what else we can welcome you back to? Back the wall. to the wall! Once again inside the wall, this time you're on your way out! Of course, while you were busy battling other villains, more spiders and mice replaced the ones you got rid of. Remember, avoid the electric bolts. A meeting with them can be quite enlightening, but not a lot of fun. And also the barbed wire, totally uncool. The mouse traps can be rather uplifting. Check it out. Awesome. Cool. I Gnarly. by my original statement that I fail to see what is cool about being inside a wall. Well, how many times have you been inside a wall? Well, considering the hole in my roof, several. <laughs> you know, you guys should probably get that taken care of. Yes. Yes, we should. Sometime. Wait, wait. So, is a hole in your roof or in your ceiling? Uh, it, it's in the ceiling. That's where Ceiling Cat made his entry. <laughs> well, it's such a big hole, it was probably where Ceiling Cat uh, brought Long Cat into the universe. <laughs> No, Ceiling Cat brought Fat Cat in. It's the funnest, best casino at Fat Cat's Casino. That's the place <laughs> to be. Do the Fat Cat stop with Big Fat Daddy C. My God, why do I know that? You tell me. I, I well, when I was a kid, I liked the Rescue Rangers. And, Who didn't? Uh, this was. Way before I knew that there were adults that really liked the Rescue Rangers. Oh, God. I think that's all that I should say on that subject. Yes. <laughs> so, yeah, by the way, we're too cool for electricity. And you know, that's that's electricity without wires even, so that's like Tesla coil stuff going on there. Tesla thumbtacks. Oh, fuck that, yeah. I, I guess that's the cool thing here. Uh, Tesla electricity. Pretty much. I mean, what the hell's up with this toy store? They, they have Tesla coils, well... Not even Tesla coils, it's just electricity from a Tesla coil. Just running around the walls. What the hell's up with that? Well, the the uh, the thumbtacks are apparently Tesla coils. I mean, you know, just imagine a Tesla coil. You know, shrink it down like you'd shrink an iPad into an iPod Touch. <laughs> and Wait, boom. isn't that the other way around? No, no, you shrink an iPad into an iPod Touch. And then you shrink an iPod Touch into an iPod Nano. Uh, Alternatively, iPod. you can call an iPod Touch an iPad Nano, but that joke's already been driven down into the ground. Probably. God. So, Ultimo, did you hear? iPods are small. No way! Maybe I should just shuffle on over and get one. Ooh, it ooh. only take a nanosecond. Ah, uh, iPod jokes. There's an app for those. <laughs> you know, there probably is. Yeah, there's an app for those. I don't know why joke apps are... I mean, I, I understand how easy they are, are to make. I just don't understand how the hell they became so popular. Okay, consider the average IQ of a person owning a smartphone. These ge these people generally think owning a smartphone makes you smart. Yeah, but 
the average IQ of a person who owns a smartphone is so low that they can't download any apps. Mm, no, 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 because the problem with that statement is people will always be able to button mash. But there aren't any buttons to mash. It's a touch screen. Exactly. The screen is one giant button. Fuck, I hate this jump. Well, not that one. I thought I was going to jump in the mouse trap again. Watch out, don't kill yourself. Gee, do you think I'm going to kill myself? <laughs> Am I that predictable? Yes. I don't know. I mean, we were making iPod jokes. This is true. And now we're making self referral and And now Never we're insulting the... ourselves. <laughs> That's all, folks? <laughs> yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> yeah, just screw it. End the video here. <laughs> <laughs> Oh uh, yeah, it's you know it's it's getting toward that part of the game where it's hard to find things to talk about in the game. Well, if we don't finish the game, then Doctor Willy Wily Wily Willa Willa Hams will have won. Classy. Yeah, this is true. Or is it just straight up dog dog the wowie? Well, you know, since the game is just going back and rehashing its old assets. Maybe we should go back and rehash our own assets to match it. Hey, don't talk about my assets like that. Don't kill yourself, Ultimo. So, about that music. Yeah, I downloaded it onto my iPod. <laughs> but wait, what about your iPad? I'm too poor for an iPad. I have a Toshiba Smart Pad. And by that, I mean I have a math book. Oh, okay. I just got no material. That's okay, you're in the wall. There's plenty of material. There's some chicken <laughs> wire, some thumbtacks, Tesla coil thumbtacks, I might point out. Yes. Some wood, some wires. I think those are wires. Um, I'm thinking giant screw things, too. With really, really randomly placed, um... I, I could see them being giant screw thingies. The thing is, I can't think of what in a wall would use that kind of screw. Well, look at this wall. There's, like, fencing in the back of this wall. Well, actually, no, it's not in the back of the wall. It's in front of the back of the wall. Well, well, keep in mind that this is a cutaway view, so that's also at the front. It's just not being shown because it is uh, behind the camera, so to speak. So, basically, what you're saying is that it's actually at the back of the front of the back of the wall. No, no, no. You, you see the, 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 the uh, cabling, the wire cabling thing that you see there is in the back of the wall, and there's also another layer in the front of the wall that isn't being rendered. Because, you know, it would just get in your way and obscure your field of vision. So they made the obvious design choice and uh, removed it for you. Even Actually, though it completely obliterates all of the realism. Well, basically I've been just talking about the chain link fence that's kind of scattered randomly. Yeah, there, it's it's going to be symmetrical, and that's also going to be on the front end of the wall. Oh, oh, okay. Wait, no. <laughs> Fuck logic. <sighs> I ain't no Vulcan. This isn't logic, this is architecture. So what, you're saying, you're saying, you're saying that Vulcans can't be architects? Is that what you're saying? This is true. <laughs> Have you ever seen an architect that is a Vulcan? Good question. There right, you maybe go. I have, maybe I haven't watched that far in the series the yet. The Vulcans have, there, there is no such established architecture 
for Vulcan kind uh, that we see until after they meet the humans. So what you're saying is they lived outside naked. It is the only logical definition, <laughs> yes. Somehow logic has become naked Vulcans. <laughs> what the shit? <laughs> I blame the game. <laughs> yes, yes, it's Vulcan. No, it's the asbestos in the wall. <sighs> it's doing it to us. No, there, there isn't. There doesn't appear to be any asbestos in this wall. I, I do gotta give them props for that. Well, so no, it's, it's just I, that you can't, it, you can't see on this layer. The, the rodent control leaves something to be desired. So yeah, um, about what would you value the, this place at? Um, uh, depends on which city this place is at. Um, I'm I'm gonna go ahead and say it's uh, city of the city of YouTube. Is that in California, Texas, or Washington? No, no, it's it's uh, it's in Maxis Land. Okay, then in that case, that <laughs> would be a uh, thirty-five simoleons. Okay, uh, so th this place is thirty-five simoleons. Yep. I thought you—I thought you said it was gonna be worth more than that. Well, like I said, I mean, if, if this was say in San Diego, California, uh, it would probably be a good solid one hundred seventy-six thousand dollars. Okay. Location, location, location. True. And if this was beachside property, you know, we're we're looking in the lower millions here. Yeah, it is right. It is rather too bad that this this is located in YouTube. I mean, while YouTube is a gigantic city, it does have its slums. And if if this was say in New Jersey, you know, we would be paying you to take it. Ha! Ah. I don't want to find the cage. I already found the cage. Go away. Yeah, why why would we be getting that message when we already know where the cage is? Well, maybe you didn't see it the first time around. Wait, maybe it's a different kind of cage, like Nicolas Cage. Maybe there's a secret cage that gives you an optional path, a, a hard <laughs> mode, if you will, a special world. Hey, we heard you like hard mode, so we put hard mode in your hard mode so you can die while you die. Cool. Okay, time to free off friends and be all cool in the process. Don't die, Ultimo. <laughs> just, to, just to spite you, I should put up another video where I do. <laughs> okay, that's it for this level. We're gonna calculate our score and play the bonus stage. Oh yeah. Yeah, that that enormous bonus stage that we have to explore. Oh man, that was some bonus stage. Yeah, you guys didn't even get to see it. It was too, it was too cool for you. And with that, that's a wrap.